So how many idiots do you think it takes to kill a god? Ten? A hundred? A thousand? Today, we're going to find out. So for this video, if we go to our world laws, we're going to be disabling diplomacy, rebellions, hunger, old age, and we're going to be enabling angry villagers. As well as if we go to our power box, world laws, we're going to be enabling regeneration. So how this video is going to work is we're going to spawn a thousand idiots on this side of the map and one demigod on this side of the map. Then we're going to give them until year 100 to develop their nations a bit, and then they're gonna kill each other. So first off, let's spawn the idiots. So we'll put them over here. Um, it's probably gonna take forever. <laughs> Two hours later. Wait, why are there only, should be more. Why are there only 996? All right, we'll spawn a few more. One, two, three, four. All right, so we got the idiots over here. We'll give them the stupid trait. Then we'll name this city, um, let's just call it Stupid, Stupid Town. And the kingdom we'll just call the Idiots. And then if we go over here, we'll do the Demigods. So we'll just spawn one of them. And let's go ahead and name this guy Melvin. We'll give him the Demigod trait. And then if we go to the village, we'll just call it, we'll just call it like Olympus or something. Yeah, Olympus. And we'll just call them the gods. All right, so I think we can go ahead and start. Oh, I guess we did already start. <laughs> I, I meant to pause this, but it's okay. Okay, so already the idiots have already built a second colony. They got Yibwana <laughs> with population 14, 16, 17. Okay, they're going up quick. Though I guess it's not that they're actually increasing. I think they're just sending guys from here to here. <laughs> oh, nice. And they built a little house too. Shoot. Okay, so they're getting their population or their uh, culture up. So level one, building houses. Okay, and Olympus is starting to go up too. So there's a little mini Melvin running around. Dang, Melvin's already putting him to work. <laughs> this kid's only like six years old. He's already like working a full-time job over here. All right, gods are up to five and idiots up to a thousand. Um, I'm sure it's, it's probably gonna take them a while to actually be able to get their population up. This village is um, 35 out of 24. So they're starting to get there. I'm surprised they haven't built any more colonies because they have like a thousand people living in this tiny little town over here. <laughs> There's like a thousand people living in 10 houses. Oh, okay. The population is going up and they did just build a new village. So that's good. They built two new villages. See, so we got, um, Muan, uh, with two and Pick Pichun Sin with seven. Okay, so they're really gonna start increasing uh, pretty soon here. We're almost at year 20, and then gods are up to 15 population. Oh, and the gods just elected Melvin as their king. That's great, but he deserves it though. I mean, he did technically like found this entire village. <laughs> so it makes sense. All right, let's take a look at the cultures. I think I saw the idiots might have an army. Yeah, they do. Okay, nice. They got a little army over here, and it looks like they are developing stone weapons. So I kind of want to look at... Wait, <laughs> wait, how is that guy so weak? What? Why does he only have 40 health? I don't understand. I don't think I've ever seen this before. Yeah, everyone... People don't usually have... Yeah, people should have 100. I have no idea why this guy only has 40. <laughs> Unless... Oh, it's the sword. Shoot, I didn't even realize that was a thing. So this sword, like, it subtracts... 60 health and it gives them an extra 24 damage and 30 attack speed I, <laughs> I don't even know if that's really worth it. He's just gonna die so quick. But anyways, let's take a look at the cultures real quick just to see um, What level they are so you got level six for the idiots. So they're developing swords as well as house tier two and then the demigods are <laughs> Pretty much just developing houses, so which is kind of funny. I mean, I guess it makes sense. If you get enough idiots together, maybe they'll, like, do something right. It's just funny that they're developing faster than, like, the literal gods over here. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and fast forward this a little bit. Nice, so we're up to year 70. Idiots are up to almost 1,200 population, and they've got almost 200 army, which is really impressive, actually. Yeah, they got tons of army just, just hanging around. And it looks like the idiots are level 19, so they're developing copper as well as axes and bows. And 
a lot of other things that we don't care about. And the demigods, oh, and they're uh, developing copper too, which is surprising. I feel like nations never develop copper this early. Nice, and it looks like they developed a new colony down here. Um, Ohorovo, <laughs> what is going on? Why are they all like attacking each other? Oh, I think they're trying to kill this cat, but the cat's got the demigod trait. <laughs> I must have accidentally given it to him earlier. That's so funny. This cat's just like immortal. All right, nice. And they, it looks like they do have an army and they do have copper. So they, I feel like we should see some guys with copper stuff. There's gotta be at least one. <laughs> now it looks like they all just have sticks. Oh, well, it really doesn't make that much of a difference for the demigods. I mean, copper would give them like three extra damage <laughs> when they already have like 255. So uh, I don't think it really matters. All right, let's go ahead and go five times speed. I think we're at, you're at year 80 right now. I wonder if the idiots are developing a lot of copper stuff. It looks like I see like a copper bow in here. Oh, it's a special copper bow. <laughs> Yadalier. Yeah, they got like cap copper axes and stuff. So that's good. Are these guys still fighting this cat over here? <laughs> You've been fighting him for like 10 years give up i don't even know why they want to kill this guy anyways yeah this poor guy he's just been getting beaten up for years <laughs> he's crippled and it only has one eye rip well good luck oh wait what the heck one of the demigods just died <laughs> but how there's there's nothing here that can kill anyone it was another immortal cat or something yeah i don't know what that was but it destroyed like a ton of the gods houses rip <laughs> oh and we just reached year 100. Dang. Yeah, that was terrible timing for them to lose a bunch of guys. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and uh, open up the middle here and we'll send them to war. Oh, here comes the idiots. <laughs> they have so much army. Oh my gosh, how much army do they have now? They've got 358 oh, yeah. army right now. What the heck? Yeah. <laughs> They've got so much. They're just gonna, they're gonna get totally wiped out though. Yeah, the demigods are just walking through them. And you just had a, I just felt another explosion. I don't know what that was. Oh, it was a demigod like in their base. Wait, what? How did this happen? <laughs> the demigods must have sent in like a surprise attack or something. I didn't even see them like come up here, but the, I guess they took over one of the idiot cities, Yibwana. They got three, three up here and they killed a ton of the idiots with that explosion. Yeah, their numbers are dropping so quick. Okay, idiots just destroyed that city. So they managed to clear them out. Um, but I think the idiots lost like all of their army. Yeah, there's their numbers are still going down super quick I don't even know what's killing them. <laughs> oh, it's some guy in here Who's this guy? Eru? Dang. Yeah, he's just destroying them. He must be. Yeah, he's level 10. That's why. Oh, okay They just killed him But that was a huge blow to the idiots. I wish I could look to see how many guys he killed because <laughs> I swear he probably killed like like 800 of them <laughs> with how much their numbers went down. Okay, idiots kind of managed to fend off that attack. So they're down to 180. Um, and they managed to reclaim this city somehow. I guess like, I think the demigods captured it, but it was all like idiots still in the city. So I, I think it was pretty easy for them. Oh, wait, <laughs> what's going on? What is going on down here? What, what, what on earth just happened? That was like the biggest chain reaction I've ever seen. What the heck? I think the idiots just managed to kill like one of the uh, demigods and it just created like a huge chain reaction. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, the, the gods went from, what was that? They, they were at like almost 60 to 22. Dang, yeah, that, oh, there goes another one. Okay, <laughs> I think, um, I think what, what might be going on is I think the idiots captured a few of the demigods. Yeah, this guy right here, Opivi. So this guy's a demigod. So I think the idiots, when they captured this colony up here, I think there were still a few demigods in there. So now they actually have a few demigods on their team, which is gonna give them a huge advantage. I think I'm, it might honestly just be this one guy though. <laughs> what, what was his name, Opivi? Yeah, this guy's like super overpowered. Level nine. He's got full, full copper. <laughs> let's uh, let's give this guy a star. He's he's the idiots champion right now. God's down to twenty three. Idiots are, idiots are up to almost three hundred. Nice. Okay, so they've recovered really well. I can't even tell what they're fighting right now though. <laughs> 
Seems like they're shooting this guy. He's on your team. Why are you killing him? Oh, okay. These guys are actually purple guys. <laughs> For some reason, I thought they were blue. Dang. Okay, so they killed Opivi, which... Um, that's really not good. I feel like that was the idiot's kind of only hope here. But they do have the numbers to potentially do some damage, though. So hopefully... They'll just be able to overwhelm the gods. If they can at least just kill one of them. Maybe we can get another chain reaction. Because all they have to do is, this village is so small, if they could just kill one guy, it'll just create a huge chain reaction that I think will kill all of them. Oh! Okay, idiots just captured this village. Y Yamoa. Okay, they just have to kill this one guy. Come on. <laughs> Destroy him. Although that's that's assuming this guy is actually killable. <laughs> okay, he's losing health very slowly. He was at just at 300. Now he's at 281. So I think they'll be able to kill him. It's just going to take forever. <laughs> this guy's super OP. Oh, and they just killed him. All right, nice. So idiots are up to 360. Gods are up to 34. Let's go ahead and put this in uh, five times speed. All right, 16. Um, this is just going to take forever. <laughs> 19. They're like going up in number. Rip. 20. Come on. Oh! Was that it? Okay, they just killed one of them. Okay, I think there's still some guys left, but that was their last colony. So they just gotta kill, like, whatever these last people are. <laughs> Ka 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 Wee oh, there they go. Dang, so I think the idiots win then. I did not think that was gonna happen. Honestly, if it wasn't for that, like, massive chain reaction over here that just destroyed the entire demigod's base, the idiots would have just gotten destroyed because they were down to like 200 at some point and there's no way they would have been able to destroy the demigods with that so anyways um thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video be sure to give a thumbs up and i will see you next time bye <laughs>